there, you amazing people. So before I dive into our topic for this episode, I just want you to imagine something real quick. I want you to imagine turning your everyday services into something you can sell and share with the world. Sounds exciting, right? And that's exactly what we're covering today in our little chat on how to turn your service into a product. I'm Ursu, and I'm so happy to spill the beans on this game-changing move with my favorite people. I'm so glad to have you here today, and I'm sure it's gonna be a lot of fun as we learn a lot of new stuff along the way. So without further ado, let's go. First up, let's talk about what productization of services means. Well, it's like turning your service-based product into a sleek product-based powerhouse. Think software applications you can sell or license to other businesses. Why? Because it's all about scaling up your business without increasing your stress levels. And trust me, we all want that. Now let's break it down. We're talking about dissecting your service into its essential components. This not only optimizes efficiency, but also makes it a breeze for customers to understand and buy what they need. It's much like creating a menu where clients can pick and choose efficient and customer friendly at the same time. Next hurdle, figuring out what parts of your service can be automated. I admit that it's a bit of a puzzle at first glance, but once you crack it, you're golden. Whether it's the whole customer experience or just specific parts, the key is to ensure we preserve its quality. Nobody wants to lose the good stuff and pursue automation, trust me. Now here's a game changer for you. Delegate some parts of your service to your team. Imagine a housekeeping service offering a line of cleaning products for customers to use between their visits. It's a win-win, new revenue stream and a more convenient experience for your customers. Now let's talk money. Traditionally, it used to be all about hourly rates, but with productization, we're moving towards value-based pricing. It's a game changer. Clients pay for results after all, not just time. Plus, it aligns everyone's interest and makes scaling up a walk in the park. <sighs> the ins and outs of making it all happen. So with the rise of productized services, having a solid marketing and sales plan is non-negotiable. Define your target market, craft a compelling sales pitch, and set a pricing strategy that screams value. And trust me, it's the key ingredient to achieving success. And now for the fun part, friends, let's talk about perks. One major benefit, a recurring revenue stream. Sell your product as a subscription service and voila, a steady flow of income. It's basically like having your very own money tree in your backyard. And customers love it too. Easy sign up, no fuss. So how do you actually do it? Simple. Create a system that takes the guesswork out for your clients. Develop questionnaires, provide guidelines, make it foolproof. And don't stop there. Offer additional products or services that complement your core offering. It's like a service buffet in who doesn't love options? Okay, it's time for real world examples now. Think prepackaged consulting services, fixed price web design, or even social media marketing packages. These are the real MVPs of the productized services game. We all know that money talks and so does pricing. You've got three options, value-based, cost-based, or a mix of both. Choose wisely because it directly impacts your profitability. Take a deep dive into the pricing pool before making the plunge. Now it's time to get your product out there. Define your target market, create a stellar sales page, drive traffic like a pro, convert visitors into customers, and don't forget to upsell. It's a marketing dance and you are the star. Last but not least, how do you scale this beauty? So as I say with everything else, consistency is key. Make sure that your service can be delivered like clockwork. Keep it user-friendly and competitively priced. Scale it up and watch your business soar. So my awesome friends, that's the scoop on turning your service into a profit-pumping masterpiece. If you dig the wisdom we just dropped, please give it a virtual high five, hit that subscribe button, and share the love with all your fellow entrepreneurs. I'm Narsu, and I'll be here to share another informative and fun episode with you next week. Until then, if you have any questions, please feel free to drop them in the comment section below. See y'all later.